damage that truck. We have an opportunity here. Stay quiet and get close. Multiple targets. We got options, Sarge. All fire on the truck! At the truck! Pull it back! Move up! Keep at him! They're down! MG on that half track! Split up! Find another way round! Suppress the half track, MG! On okay, Kingsley! Keep him covered! Focus on that door! I got a beat on the door! Gunford. Richard said I'd gone mad. Sometimes, a little madness is called for. I think deep down he understood that, and realized we were cut from the same cloth. Went up 
up ahead. I think they're waiting on you, Sarge. Look at those defences. Bloody hell. They're waiting at the table up here. How's it looking, Sergeant? Best see for yourself. Let's get you the lay of the land. Our targets are the guns housed in those casemates. And we can only get there through a horde of Germans armed to the teeth. Think you can handle taking out the lower gun? I fancy my chances. That bunker's our way in, but it's packed with MGs. It'll be a hard push. First job's getting across that minefield. But that anti-tank ditch could be useful. I've got an idea. I'm all ears. We can punch a hole through the mines with those blitzers there. And the bunker will make minced meat out of us as soon as they hear the engines coming. We're going quiet then. No engines. Bail at the last second, let gravity do the work. That should get us to the ditch at least. Well? I love it. But I think you should go first. <laughs> all right then. As soon as you hit the ditch, get the men ready. Tommy, you with me? Oh, yeah. Drive through the minefield, take the bunker, strap some thermite to some highly explosive weapons. Piece of piss, Sarge. And you, get a second sun burning in the sky. If our ships don't see that flare, if they don't know we've won, they'll fire on the guns and risk taking us with them. Well, I don't know about you, but I think I'll take very little consolation in knowing that the fire that killed me was friendly. Don't worry, Gov. I won't forget to aim up. Truck's ready. We'll be right behind you. Godspeed, Kingsley. Case mates, I'll take the upper ones. Don't forget the flare. Let's move up. Go, Sarge. All right, boys, this is it. You're on me. Tommy! 
Try and get back! We need to clear the door! All right, lads! One of you! With me! Press it fire now! Track now. Don't cheat out. Let's fall him back. Keep pushing. In the left half track. Watch that half track. Move, move. In the left half track. Gunner is down! MG's a target! Stay behind the half-track! Don't give those MG's a target! Move this thing, now! Stick on it, lads! Stay covered! Almost there! Seven. Sergeant. 
One down, one to go. That's the last of the thermite. Sarge, I could use your help here. Webb did his part. Shit! Take cover! Smoke ready! Clear him out! Smoke up! Go! Case made it clear. How are we blasting this one? We're out of thermite. I'll feed it a Bangalore. Let's get up top before this thing explodes. You have the flare, Sarge? Bombardment's close. Go! Get out and fire the flare! Sergeant, the flare! Bombardment's any minute! Damn! Flare's ruptured! You've got to be fucking joking! Where's Webb? There! Lower case, mate! Incoming! Get down! I'm going for Webb's flare! Get everyone to cover! We need to run for it! Time to take a kip. I was just waiting for some mad bastard to come and save the day. Well, let's you and I signal our boy, shall we? But we'd won the day, and we'd honored the memory of all those we lost the only way we could by completing the mission. You look at the soldiers under your command and hope that they can do the difficult thing, the impossible thing. That flare told me I'd been right. This is what it means to be a leader. <laughs>